Sports on News Channel 8 is brought to you by Honda. We are less than 48 hours from Super Bowl 49, and people are asking me who I'm picking to win, Patriots or Seahawks. Well, I'm going with the Seahawks, but I guarantee you my opinion isn't what matters to you or especially the players and coaches participating. Nope, because it's all about those beasts, about those beasts. No people. Here they are. Talk about the animals and this year's Super Bowl predictions from the animals across the country. Before you win the Super Bowl, first, you got to earn the respect of the animal kingdom. I think that's the major motivation. Everybody's watching, everybody cares. That's where all of our attention is. We begin in Sarasota. Hugh and Buffett the manatees. You're talking about two of the best in the game. But they split their vote. Hugh picks the Patriots. Buffett chooses the Seahawks. Just don't overthink it. Okay, how about Rudy the Rooster? cock a doodle doo Rudy picks the Seahawks, even though chickens and hawks usually don't get along. That doesn't mean that we always make the right choices and we do the right things. Then there's Lee Lee the Panda, a huge Tom Brady fan. We have a great relationship. We always have. That's why Lee Lee can overlook Deflate Gate by wrapping up in a Patriots blankie. I think it's, um, you know, the winter months, and I certainly hope he's proud of me. Hey, Katy Perry, what animals do you want to see? Both a lion and sharks. No can do on the sharks, but here's your lion, and he picks the Patriots. Maybe you don't feel that that's what he should do. But a confident crew of critters continue taking New England. Artemis the giraffe? Patriots. Cowley the terrier dog? Patriots. But wait, did Bill Belichick scare Callie into picking the Pats? He listens when you tell him to do something. You know, he really tries hard to do it. How about Bubbles the Elephant? Patriots again! Once you get to that point, really nothing else matters. But will Teddy the Porcupine also go against the Seahawks? You know, if he's faced with that decision, uh, we'll support him. Rest easy, coach. Teddy happily selects Seattle. His positive energy, uh, he, it feeds off to everybody else. And if you think Marshawn Lynch won't talk, wait until he sees Salty the Crocodile. He takes the Seahawks, too. <laughs> That's all I really, that matter to me. But the game that will mean the most to the animals is not the Super Bowl, but Puppy Bowl 11. I obviously did not know it was a topic of national debate, honestly. <laughs> I'm glad we finally found something Marshawn Lynch cares about. Right. He cares about I was that. beginning to wonder, but... You know, how many animals can there be? I mean, we've, we've, Just we've covered them all. Just a few more every year. And I think we got them all on our newscast. We've got everything. Right. Possums the week, and cats gator, and dogs. And, gator, and you lion. got everything in between. All right. That's it. Oh, my God. Got to move on. Yeah. Now. We'll be right back with the winning lottery stuff. numbers. No sharks, though. <laughs>